at the bottom of the valley down there, through the trees, I've attracted the attention of a deer, which, oh, there it goes. <laughs> oh, there's a couple of them down there. They're all heading for the trees the other side now. And of course, I don't have my long lens on, so although they can see me, there they go, there goes the other one. I won't go running in there too fast, there's a wolf in there somewhere. <laughs> I just saw him further up the bottom of this valley. I don't know if we can see them with the sun. Let's get in the shade here a bit. Down in the bottom here there's some uh, native um, ceremonial sites. And they have, I'm not sure what they were, I can't remember now. There's, they have little flags and things there. and it's, uh, There's several of them down through this valley. It's very nice, nice to see them. Yeah, the deer have gone. Actually, the most bear activity I've seen in this region was actually in that clump of trees over there. I saw two bears in that piece. I took a shortcut back once when it was raining, and it, I just headed straight north, which brought me up through that piece of forest. And uh, there was a couple of bears in there. They heard me coming. They soon disappeared. They don't hang around long. People think there's bears hiding behind every tree, but they hear you long before you hear them. Right, I'm heading out the other end of that valley and then heading south behind all those trees.